Guys and girls, welcome back to the Green Light. We have a special one today. Is Valorant boring? Okay, this is the one question I want to have asked in this video. Okay, is Valorant boring? I've been seeing article after article talking about how boring Valorant is, how viewers won't want to watch Valorant. Okay, the numbers are declining. Okay, on Twitch. Is it really boring? We're about to find that out today, boys. Stay tuned. Okay, the green light is here to answer your questions. Okay. Now, uh, we do have access to Valorant. We're going to click play now. Um, let me take you guys on a quick detour real quick. Um, I, I want to show you some of the weapons that they have in this game. And uh, so you guys can form your own opinions about this, you know. We're we'll going to do the, uh, the shooting test, okay? The music in this game is pretty fantastic, I think. Um, it's, 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 it's nice. It's nice. So uh, I haven't played too many of these people. I played this healer chick. I'm just going to go ahead and pick Phoenix just because he was the first one I played and I kind of understand his abilities. He is a duelist. You have duelists, centennials, initiators, controllers. Oh, uh, yeah, that's it. Basically, duelist is like an in-your-face type of guy. I'm picking Phoenix. Um, he has like a blind. Uh, this little curve ball is a flare bomb or something like that. So it goes around the corner and blinds you. The hot hands, you throw a fireball or some shit. The C is f like a wall. It's called blaze. Oh, this is like, this is pretty cool actually. You get to like run in straight into fire. And then when you die, you get put back where you were when you started the ability. So that's a pretty cool ultimate. I, ha I haven't done it too much. But we're going to go ahead and lock in. Right when we jump in. I mean, the game feels very, very nice. You know, it's very, I mean, I did just get a new computer <laughs> and I'm in love with every game that I'm playing right now, but, uh, you know, it's, it feels very fluid. It just feels sharp. You know, it feels as sharp as it needs to be. It feels as sharp as CS, I feel like, but it looks better. You know, this looks better. So you got a nice little shooting range. I love the fact that they have this shooting range, you know, I love a, a game that has a dedicated, uh, practice, like practice station or whatever because you can practice practice the mechanics of the game you know and you get better that way i feel like instead of using like outside aim programs and stuff like that anyways i'm going to show you guys some of the guns so you got your smgs here and you got your shotguns here this is like a i don't know what to call this shit but it's uh it's serious okay let's just say it's serious oh shit shooting guns in this game feels really really good and that's probably like one of the only reasons that I've, well, okay, let me not, let me not get too ahead of myself here. Uh, let's just say I enjoy coming back to this game to shoot, okay? Like I enjoy shooting in this game a lot. It feels good. That's one thing it has going for it. It just feels very, very tight. They did a great job on that. This is kind of like the uh, AK-47. It's a rifle in the game. You guys will probably be using this a lot. I mean, this feels so great to shoot. It feels great to shoot in this game. And you can aim down sights. Yeah, that's your AK-47 right there. Uh, you know, you got your sniper rifle. Uh, this is the like the high power sniper rifle right here. It's very nice. It sounds great too. You know, you got your regular lower power, like scout rifle type of deal right here. <laughs> Obviously, I haven't been using the sniper rifle, but in due time, in due time. Then you got your heavies. You know, you got your para here. It's your para boys, it goes wild. You got your whatever the hell this is, but I don't want to get hit by it. Gun. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You don't want to get hit by this. Oh, something that sounds like this. You got to shoot him in the body. You got to let it chop that body up. You know, I like that one. That is the Ares right there. Uh, it's the Bulldog. So the Bulldog is like a a lighter uh assault rifle 
sounds very good. That's another thing about this game is the sounds are very nice. The sounds are very, very nice, very pleasing. They make you feel like you're playing a quality game, like a high, high quality game. At times it may, you feel like it could be a little too bland. At the same time, it's, it's kind of just beautiful. It's just the type of game that you have to respect because it's so well put together. It looks amazing. It feels amazing. It sounds amazing. Even if it is a little boring i feel like it has so much potential that it could be like one of the most amazing games we've ever seen the only thing i don't necessarily like about it too much is that it i feel like it's a, a bit too reminiscent of csgo like i wish that they add something that really sets it apart as far as i mean the ability set it apart for sure i mean and I think that's really, at the end of the day, that's really what's going to really set this game apart from other uh, other FPS games are their implementation of the abilities. Right now, I feel like they're not too, too exciting, especially when like you just got walls going up and shit like that. I don't know, but I, I just know that this game is beautiful and it runs very well. It's like, it's, it's, it's very nice. It's very nice. If there's any draw to this game, it's definitely that it's well put together. So this gun is the Guardian. I'm gonna show you guys this one and then I'm gonna get into a game. You guys can go check out the rest of them. Uh, when you get a drop, hopefully you have a drop by now. Um, I I watched Valorant streams for like maybe a couple days, and I ended up getting one. And I ended up getting one when I wasn't even watching the stream, which was weird. I was just like, "What the hell? They gave me Valorant." Like I never get into betas either, so I'm one of those people, guys. I feel your pain if you don't have a beta key. I feel your pain. Trust me. Uh, I've been there. <laughs> But thankfully, I, I did get one, so I, I am enjoying it, you know. I haven't been playing it every day because I have work and other obligations and stuff. When I do have time, I'm always like, hmm, should I play some Valorant, you know? Like, kind of want to play some Valorant. But sometimes I'm like, oh, I don't feel like having to try hard, you know. All right, guys, so we're going to get into a game now, and we're going to show you guys how the game plays against actual people, okay? Stay tuned, keep those green lights on, and we're going to be right back. All right, guys and gals, we are here. We are ready to play. Play now. Okay, we should find a match in no time because everyone is on the circle jerk. That is Valorant. Okay, we got into a match. All right. Uh, I have everyone on mute right now because um, I don't, I don't. Oh, this guy picked my guy. I haven't played any of these people before, this one or this one. So this will be interesting, guys. <laughs> Uh, this guy's a duelist. I'm just going to go ahead and pick the duelist just because uh, that's who I've played in the past. This will be interesting, boys. This will be interesting, okay? Valorant first impressions. Let's go. All right, so uh, one thing we haven't talked about is the buying system. They fear death. They should fear so much more than that. Damn, calm down, kid. Yeah. You have to buy abilities, right? They don't cost much. You can always pretty much have them. And then you could buy, you know, whatever you want to buy. And you have your body armor right here. I didn't realize they had body armor until, like, I played my third match and shit. Anyways, you have your bomb sites, just like CS. So we're going to go, you know, try to plant the bomb somewhere. Oh, over here. Um, so... Uh, Healing you. My Q is... Or is my C-Mark smoke bomb? Okay, this makes me go faster. Oh, shit. I put that smoke bomb out. Ooh. Well, that was fun. Uh, that felt very, very nice. It felt good. It felt good. Um, playing that right there, it was fun. It was fun. So I, I, I can't even lie. Last player oh, I jump. Okay. I'm going to go with the bulldog. And we're going to try to make something happen. Okay. Yeah, my aim in this game is kind of cool. What? What was that? <laughs> So we're getting stomped, obviously. 
This is the Guardian. It's a pretty nice gun. Like, it's it's a one-shot gun. When you're chopping somebody up with this, it feels great, actually. Damn. Ten seconds left. So, yeah, these guys are trying pretty hard here. One thing about this game is it feels like it takes a long-ass time to, to finish a match. And I, I'm not really a huge fan of games like that. I, I like to be able to finish a match in, like, 25 minutes max, you know? And these games feel like they can take literally, like, years. Well, not years, obviously. Yeah, I don't know why I was in there like that. So, guys, I mean, this is pretty much the game. You know, you got your abilities. You got your guns. You, I mean, it's pretty straightforward. There's not much else than this. I mean, you go plant your bombs. There's no special objectives or anything else. It's a pretty straightforward game. And uh, I think that's why a lot of people are, are saying that it's kind of boring. Is because, like, we've already seen this. We have this with CS. We have, like, Overwatch we can play. It's like this is kind of like Overwatch, but you only have one game mode. You know? You might as well play overwatch at least you you can play other game modes that might make using abilities more fun add depth to the game instead of it pretty much being a cs clone that's just my take on it Ooh, get chopped up let's go kids oh shit keep yourself together that was nice so i have my ultimate we are going to use the ultimate ability. That would be a good thing to do. Let's try to chop somebody up, boys. I don't know how long it lasts or if I can just do this forever. But uh, you don't want to fuck with this right here. You do not want to mess around. You do not want to mess around. Come at me. They're coming. They are coming. We planted the spike. Get in position. Opponents killed. Good job. One enemy remaining. Ooh, took my kill, but good job. Good job. Took my kill again, but good job. Good job. That was a team effort. All right, guys. So uh, you pretty much seen everything this game has to offer. There are no other game modes, like I said. My overall summary is that it's a very beautiful looking game. The mechanics are very, very tight. Shooting feels very, very good. Gun designs are very well done. As far as it being boring, I think only time will tell if it's truly going to be a boring game. I believe it's going to be one of the most competitive games played. I, I, I think the game will do well. I think it will do very, very well, actually. I feel like it has a lot of potential, so... I will be, uh, you know, following the game. I don't know if I'm going to be playing it all that much. It's not necessarily my cup of tea. You might see me play from time to time. So, hope you guys liked the review. Hit the like and subscribe if you did. Keep those green lights on. And I will catch you guys on the next one. Peace.